parents and, and families and kids walk into the complexes, I want them to have a moment of, oh dang, are they talking about me? Three years ago, Blue Cross and Blue Shield partnered with the Royals to create a program called Shut Out the Stigma with a goal of shining a light on behavioral health. Now we continue this mission by focusing on youth athletes and trying to understand the root causes of our current mental health crisis. With the idea of the letters, really we wanted to hear from the voice of the youth athletes. And so we did a poll and a survey in the area with many youth athletes across multiple sports to actually hear from them and see what they had to say about whether it be the ride home or the criticism from coaches or parents and really get a breath for what they're saying. And then we kind of collected that and we created these letters from actual words from these kids' surveys. In this case, we feel like Kansas City Royals and Blue KC is kind of a one plus one equals three. So the stretch and reach that our two organizations can have around the city and in this community, we think really maximizes the value of the partnership. The installations, I think, are hopefully things people, even if you have children that are not athletes, is that this really resonates with every parent who's working to build young, Kansas Cityans that are holding up the ideals of our community. I'm proud that the Kansas City Royals are willing to step outside of the play and performance on the field to lean into the community and its needs and to help shine a light and normalize what so many of us suffer. We believe that this message is going to resonate with families and coaches and athletes and youth from all sports throughout the entire area. And so that's why we want to move this around. We want to move it around to basketball courts. We want to move it around to volleyball courts, to wherever sport is played, because that's where youth and families are at. Ultimately, we hope that these letters in this film gives kids a voice who haven't necessarily had one. You know, let them decide what they want to talk about, and hopefully it'll give kids the ability to say, I'm not alone. <laughs>